I can't attack him. I tried. He does a barrier. More high in life. It is bounty time. And next is Dr. Giblets. You're going down, Dr. Giblets. Klug sent over the details on an extremely powerful Gatlian. Supposedly he's in the possession of another G3 officer. A scientist named Dr. John Giblets. And guess what? I can't find shit on him. I don't even know where he is. I'm sending you to Blim to gather intel. I went ahead and unlocked a new feature on your bounty suit. You're welcome. Detective mode. It looks like we have to investigate the locals. Okay, we'll ask this guy. Why do you look so nervous? Make him nervous with his interrogation. Where is Dr. Giblets? I don't know who that is. Well, that was useless. Let's ask someone else. That was a real D rank interrogation. Sorry. I got a D? Uh, <laughs> this is the trial version of detective mode. Oh my god, all the ads came back. Okay, we lost this person. We need to find Dr. Giblets. I can't help you. But Blordo can. Blordo? Okay, let's go see Blordo. Okay, this is Blordo. You know anything about a, 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 where we could find a guy named Jib, Dr. Giblets? What do you think I know anything about Dr. Giblets? I don't know nothing. Now buy something or beat it, buster. Ooh, he's being very suspicious. Michael Taint said you knew something. If you're really looking for trouble, maybe check out the new High on Life store in the slums. Whoa, great sleuthing detectives. That was an S rank interrogation. Nice, an S rank. It, it, it doesn't really change anything. <laughs> Come on, let, let's get to this High on Life place. High on Life is a place? Kenny, I thought this was what, a video game. What are you doing to my brain? It's so easy navigating the slums this way. Wow, look at this place. That, that's that got to be the high on life store. Uh, excuse me, cut in the queue, please. Who do I talk to here? Maybe ask this guy. Thanks for shopping at high on life. I'm the manager here. Are, are you finding everything okay? He's the manager. Where can we find Dr. Giblets? I just work here. I don't know anything about the store or who built it. Or I'm, I'm kind of a fuck up. Welcome to high on life. I'm Derek. Uh, I can be a personal uh, high on life uh, prof professional today. Um, do, do, that makes sense, right? That, does that sound okay? I'm I'm new here. Oh, he's new, so he couldn't possibly know our Dr. Giblets is, right? Hey, hey, it's my first day. Uh, can you do me a favor and not mention Dr. Giblets around here? They told us not to talk about him. All right, that was the last one. Let's head back. This wannabe bounty hunter doesn't seem to be shopping. They seem to be on my case. Fresh mouth on you, kid. Be a shame if something happened to that mouth as a result. Stay out of this, got it? We've got this covered. Whoa, they just disappeared like Men in Black or Star Trek or one of those things. What? Was this guy trampled to death? Oh, he's wearing really nice booties. I think I'll take them. Whoa. I'm Spider-Man, guys. This is my new favorite type of boots. Okay, we have to go back to Gene. Oh, a warp. How convenient. Welcome I'm back. back. We've got company. We're on your side. They're on our side. That's good. We represent Magistrate Clug Nugman. Why don't you follow us? Clug wants to speak in person. Huh, all right, let's 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 go talk to Clug. All right, let's visit Clug. Hey, Mini Lemon Superman. You think you could, you know, deal with Dr. Giblets? Let me just leave this map data right here on my desk. Okay, I'll take this map and we'll kill Dr. Giblets. Yoink. Let's kill Dr. Giblets. Oh, enemies. Gotta kill the enemies. I love killing aliens. His head's decapitated. Okay, let's visit the Moplets. The Moplets are gone. Again. Okay, maybe they got enslaved or something. Let's kill the aliens for enslaving the Moplets. Okay, I'm gonna shotgun you in the face. Boom. Shotgun! <laughs> he just jumped into that. Can I free these frogs? Go frogs! Attack the enemies. The frogs are doing nothing. I'm surprised Gus isn't saying anything about me killing his brethren. How the hell am I to get over? Not unless this is magnetic? Question mark? Oh, it is. Swing. Shooing. Oh my god, he's m disgusting. I thought you Care Bears were f made of stuffing, not guts. Oh god, I'm fading fast. Please, please, please just stay with me while I die. I, I, I don't want to be alone. Maybe you can put him out of his misery. You had, to do, you had to put him out of his misery. Exactly. God, that's disgusting. I'm gonna go this way. 
Is Dr. Giblitson here? Oh, I'm sure we'll be able to find Dr. Giblets with just a little bit of detective work. Okay, this alien got decapitated. Maybe Dr. Giblets did it? Oh, it's a drone. There must have been some sort of battle. That's the desk, like the Caravers. Huh, we need more information. Let me hack the door so we can go deeper and look for more clues. These looks like Bedeos coming out of poop. Oh, it's a robot. It's an alien robot. Dr. Giblets was even more twisted than we could ever imagine. He was torturing his own henchmen. I'm hacking the next door. Second place, John Giblets. Jeez, it looks like Dr. Giblets was pissed he didn't get first place in, in science. So he actually might just be evil. While you were wasting time doing detective work, I was busy scanning the area for Dr. Giblets and decrypting the password on his security systems. Now you can just follow the waypoint right to him. All right, so we just have to kill Dr. Giblets. Cool. Hello, Dr. Giblets. Oh, there he is. Oh, he's injured. What the hell? Yeah, I love this boss. He made it so easy for me. Stabby. Entering full security lockdown. Uh -oh. If you're hearing this pre-recorded message, it means you've successfully managed to murder one of the greatest minds in all of super science. Now see if you can survive my retribution from beyond the grave! Honestly, this level looks like the very start of this game. I don't know if you remember the episode 1. Attack! We have to get out. It's too easy. I'll try attacking the wall. So many frogs. Okay, I gotta get out of this space. Too many frogs, too many police officers. I think it's ironic that he just tripped over and died. So hilarious. I didn't see that coming, honestly. Had to attack this. It just got really hard all of a sudden. These, these goddamn freaky guys. If I fall, it's like toxic poison. Big giant boys. Only one person could have survived all of that. Myself! I killed myself! How could you kill yourself and still be alive? That is confusing. I hope you'll forgive me for making you go through all of that. You can leave now. Have a good day. Jim is out. All the poison mist disappeared. Okay, let's get out of here. Okay, we got this Gatlion. We got a new gun. Busted. Let's do it. What the hell to let's do it? I just wanted to say your free trial of detective mode is up. So see you later. Bye. Oh, thank God. Okay, bounty hunter, you go through the menus. You find that detective mode. You shut it the fuck off. Delete it. J delete it. It's a whole mission. It'll be a whole DLC mission. Every last peso we've ever earned, we pay whoever it is to delete this fucking detective mode bullshit. You're funny, Kenny. Okay, let's go home. Uh, so we did find Dr. Giblets. Um, he is dead, but we also found another Gatlian. It's not really functional. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't think he's dead, but. Oh, God damn. Yeah, he's busted up real bad. Look at his face. <laughs> I can definitely fix it. Okay, th thanks, Gene. Turn in your bounty real quick. I've got some good news and some bad news. I wonder what the news is. Okay, well, guys, we beat Dr. Giblets. Or rather, he. Beat himself? Come on over. Oh, which one? I usually like hearing bad news, and then the good news is less painful to hear. Here's the bad news. Lizzie's been gone for a while. You might want to look into it, since she's your sister and all. Maybe check with Tweeg. He works at that Space Applebee's uptown. Okay, looks like we have a mission, guys. What's the good news? Right, well, I lied, kid. I don't have any good news. I was hoping you'd just ask for the bad news and then you'd be so upset you'd forget to ask about the good news. Sir. What, Gene? That's so bad of you. Bounty Hunter, you mind if we leave the other Gatlians here with Gene and maybe we can go poke around for Lizzie and use that time to have a little chat with each other? You know, just you and me. All right, we'll leave the other Gatlians here, I guess. Wonder why Kenny's saying that. Okay, let's try and find Lizzie. <laughs> you, you'd never judge me, right? I mean, we're such close partners at this. I'd never judge you, Kenny. You're my best friend. How did Lizzie get all the way to Applebee's? Because that's really far away for a girl without a jetpack. We're wondering if someone named Tweeg is working today. He didn't show up for his shift, sorry. Do you still want a table? Um, you know what? You know what? Maybe this is a good spot to talk. Uh, yes. 
Honestly, I would enjoy this place if it was in real life. Look at Kenny. He looks like a withered old man. He wants to get something off his chest. I'm hungry. <laughs> Well, you know, we are at Space Applebee's. I mean, so I'm gonna, um, I I'm gonna tell you my whole deal, if, if that's cool, while, while you chomp. Okay, so you remember what happened on my home planet, Gatlas? It got taken over by the G3. What if it was kind of, you know, just a little tiny bit entirely my fault? I I'm not the only reason the G3 invaded Gatlas. I'm just the only reason they even knew about it in the first place. Hey there, welcome to Applebee's. I'm gonna be your waiter for the day. Can I get you started? with one of our signature cocktails uh not not now please we're, we're kind of busy here oh he's sending me cocktails i'll say long island iced tea go ahead and get that in for you uh thank you the dramatic Just music <laughs> that's when rel del mar crashed his ship into our planet he was this crazy smuggler he he'd been all over and he'd seen it all oh that must have been the guy at the start I him fix his ship he wanted me to be a part of his crew and i'm back here we go this is for you all right now what were you thinking for an appetizer uh so, i'm sorry we're in the middle of something please fuck it let's have some chicken wings Ooh. Oh, I don't know why I picked Applebee's to tell you this, but wh where were we? Rel, you know, he had to deal with all kinds of shady customers and, well, Garmantuous, you know, he'd never seen an alien like me, you know, a talking gun with endless firepower and, you know, I was being taken advantage of. I was going nowhere. You no, know, everyone thought I was a fuck up. You know, I, I just wanted to prove to everyone that I could do something. You know. Open up. Here comes the appetizer train. Chicka 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 choo choo. Well, look at those chicken wings. Give me a sirloin steak, please. You betcha. I'm gonna get that order right to the cook. Okay, thank you. I led the G3 right to Getless. Fought them off at first, you know? But they came back with some super virus that damn near zombified everyone. We formed a rebellion. It was led by Let's Do It. He was my best friend, my mentor. He was one of the strongest Gatlians who ever lived, and I, I got him killed. In his dying moments, I told him everything, like I'm telling you now. Uh, it's not your fault, Kenny. You just hung out with a cool kid like me. It's called living your life. Or being high in life, I don't know. Let's do it, survived. Somehow, the G3 must have kept him alive to try to utilize his power. Do you see my problem, right? Like, I I'm gonna have to tell the other guns what I did, you know, or else he'll tell them. All right, I'm back. Hope those tummies are ready for some yummies. Bon appetit. Dude, take a fucking hint. Can't you see we're in the middle of a thing here? Uh-oh, someone's feeling grumpy. <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. Don't follow us. Twig and I are in love. Lizzie's messing. The galaxy and his space RV. We gotta get to them. How do we get in? Okay, this, this, this okay we have to get Lizzie. I've got some more bad news. Oh, not more bad news. Made some new commercials with you in them. Now the G3 knows where we are, so they're attacking the house. So get back here quick, or they're gonna kill me. Now, let's just ignore the battles and get the hell home there's just too many of them i'm barely surviving this good fighting everybody we just need to get home okay okay i'm going home don't you have to worry about me kenny there's loads of people holy shit they're fucking everywhere surprised to see me bounty hunter it's godless can i attack him i can't attack him i tried he does a barrier We'll have to find him in the next episode. You fucked up enormously, but we'll deal with that later. Scramble the warp! Bounty hunter, bring me to the warp core! Everywhere. The house is getting broken. Look. It's falling apart. Activate the warp car. Okay. Jesus. He looks so worried. We are all gonna die. Oh. It's the actual house that we're going through space. We're safe. Where are we? It was the only safe place I could think of. Where did Kenny bring us? Welcome to Gatlas, my home planet. Jesus. I didn't realize it was this bad. Fuck, there's nothing left. This was our home? This just looks insane. It's not as good as Blim City. Okay, we go back to Jean. What happened to your eyes, Jean? Well, obviously, the black one is damaged, but the, the, what about his... Um, pink eyes where is his pupils gone 
I tracked down Lizzie's bio signal. But she's on the move. Probably on a ship, so we have to act fast or we'll lose her. Okay, let's rescue our sister from Tweek. I don't know what I want. Okay, fine, I don't know either. Isn't the sex good? I don't know. I can't- What is she talking about? Fuck your sister, dude. Poo, cuckoo. What? <laughs> right, Tweek? Have you smoked? You were, you're a smoker. She's smoking. <laughs> You and Twee should stay together. You should be a supportive yeah, brother. How about you just let me handle this on my own? You already decided to become a weird alien killing expert. Don't strain yourself trying to be a dating expert too. Did you know I almost sold you out to the G3? They were offering like a lot of pesos to find out where you were. What the fuck, Twee? What the hell? <laughs> Twee? If Lizzie hadn't dragged me on this trip, I probably would have. I'm not good. I'm a shithead. He is such a asshole. Fuck you, Tweek. Hey, thanks for coming to get me. You got it. Smell you later, Tweek. Yeah, you're stupid, Tweek. Look at his stupid alien face. Hey, you guys are welcome back whenever you want to come back. Like, I don't give a shit. I'm lonely. Aw. We're not coming back, idiot. Oh, that's so mean. He's just lonely. Actually, his bus is kind of cool. Okay, going home. We're back. You're safe. Uh, I mean, fuck you. And a fuck you too. Uh, can you set the other guns down on the table for me real quick? Kenny's going to tell the other guns. Okay, what if I were to tell you that I'm the reason the G3 invaded Gatlas and enslaved our race? We'll be mad. I don't think I could get over it. Yeah, don't say that. You know what? It would really suck to hear you say Kenny, that. Kenny, come on. That's not true, right? No, no, no. That would be impossible. Are you doing a bit? Okay, well, there's, there's more to the story than just oh, a... Fuck, he's scrambling for words. It really is true. He really did cause the downfall of our civilization. I left Gatlas before the G3 invaded. But I ran into an alien smuggler who crashed his ship on our planet, and, and he took me with him on these adventures. But then we got mixed up doing the wrong job with the wrong crowd. Garmantuous and the G3, and I accidentally led them right to Gatlas. I thought they killed Les Do It. I, I told him everything as I watched the light leave his eyes. You mean you didn't think you'd ever have to tell us the truth? No, 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 that's not it. I, I... Oh, this is all sorts of fucked up, Kenny. I don't even know what to say. See, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I, I didn't know what I was doing. We're so close to taking down the G3. Let's just... Oh, okay. Let's just pretend you're not the reason everyone we know and love is dead, yeah? Next on the agenda, forgive Garmantuous too? Come on. Th th that's not fair. No. I hate to be this guy, but we're running out of time. We'll finish the job. And then you're out of our lives, Kenny. Come on, Sweezy. You don't mean that. Enough. Just pull yourselves together for this mission, at least. It's time to get back on track. Nipulon just flew back into his drug lounge on Port Tarine. So we got a strike now. Can you handle that? I'm proud of Kenny revealing to the other guns. But goddamn, they were just so quick to drop him as a friend. But I think he'll call it here, guys, because there was a lot of talking in this episode. And there's just two bosses left. The right-hand man and Gargantuous. So in the next episode... We'll kill them both. I hope you've enjoyed. Um, we'll see you at the next one. Bye. I know I look like I'm one of those G3 guys, but I am not in the G3. I'm like one of the few people of my species who did not join the G3. Mm, he seems crazy. I'm just going to kill him. No, come on. Would you stop with the killing for a bit?